struggle in the mornings like I do, this video will be your lifesaver, I'm promising you. So I'm going to be sharing with you guys 10 different ways you guys can become a morning person. And these tips have honestly helped me out so much, so I'm super excited to share this video with you guys. So let me know which one was your favorite in the comments and which tip you guys are going to be trying out. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you guys enjoy it and you guys want to see more of these videos from me. And don't forget to click that red subscribe button as well because it's free and easy and it just notifies you guys of when I upload a new video. So definitely click the red button down there. So my first tip for you guys would just to be to go to bed earlier. It's such a simple tip, but it makes all the difference. I promise you. If I go to bed past midnight, I'm seriously such a mess the next day. I'm a disaster. Like, you don't even want to, like, look at me. I'm such a mess. So, for me, I have to go to bed between, like, 10 or 10.30 for me to be able to wake up the next morning and just feel good. So, just go to bed earlier. It's such an easy and simple tip, and it makes all the difference. So, my second tip for you guys would just to be to set a motive. So basically the night before you go to bed, just think of what you have to do the next day and motivate yourselves to get up early and get it done so you guys can reward yourselves with something after you get what you need to get done done. So for me, if I have to film a video, it motivates me to get up early and get it done so I could like go hang out with friends after or watch Netflix after, I don't know. But yeah, just motivate yourselves to get what you need to get done done early so you can reward yourselves after. I'm 21. Baby. So my next tip for you guys would be to put your alarm across the room so when it goes off you have to get up to go get it because honestly if I put it right next to my bed I'm going to press snooze like 100 times before I actually get up so definitely put your alarm across your room and also make sure you guys set a fun alarm and not those really annoying iPhone alarms that make you want to punch your face 100 times. So maybe like set your favorite song as your alarm or I don't know, whatever you want to do because that'll motivate you to get up and get ready and get moving. Chasing after you is like a fairy tale. So my fourth tip for you guys would be just to let natural light in. So open up all your blinds, let the sunshine in and just take in the sunshine. I don't know, it puts me in such a positive mood and makes me so much more motivated to start my day when there's sunshine in my room. So I highly recommend trying to just let natural sunlight in your room if you guys can. Leave this neighborhood. Never knew love could hurt this. So my next tip for you guys would be to block out all social media because I find that when I go on social media in the mornings, I just sit on my bed and scroll through Instagram and Twitter and Tumblr and YouTube. So if I don't go on social media, I get ready so much faster and I don't know, sometimes I just feel like it's just a better start to my day with no social media. So definitely try blocking out all social media. So my next tip for you guys would be to drink warm lemon water. This is a lifesaver for me because usually I just go straight to coffee, like coffee is everything to me. And I still drink coffee, but I always drink warm lemon water before I drink my coffee to get me hydrated and get my metabolism going. So I highly recommend drinking warm lemon water first thing in the mornings and then having your coffee after. So my next tip for you guys would be if you guys can to work out in the mornings. This puts me in such a great and positive mood for the rest of the day. I don't know what it is, but after I work out in the mornings, I just feel so accomplished and so much more motivated to get things done throughout the day. So if you guys can, and if you guys have time, definitely try to work out in the mornings. And if you guys like don't really have time in the mornings, you guys can always just stretch in your room or do a quick ab workout. I don't know, just do something quick if you guys don't have a lot of time, but definitely try to find like a quick workout to do in the mornings. We'll be looking for so this next tip is probably my favorite and it's while you're getting ready, play music. 
So I love to blast music when I'm getting ready. It just gets me so pumped and puts me in the best mood ever. So like I have my record player and I just play like a bunch of records while I'm getting ready and it's just my favorite thing ever. So definitely play your favorite music and just jam out to it while you're getting ready because honestly it'll make a huge difference and it puts me in such a great mood. <laughs> for you guys might sound a little strange and a little bizarre at first but it's just to smile at yourself in the mirror for 30 seconds in the morning and just tell yourself that you can take on whatever this day brings and I just think it boosts your confidence and it just puts you in the right mindset for the day so I would really highly recommend trying this out so my last tip for you guys would be to eat a healthy breakfast it's so important it's the most important meal of the day obviously um, I love to eat oatmeal, um, egg white omelets, or smoothies, or avocado toast. I would just highly recommend eating a good breakfast because it will make you energized and motivated to do whatever you need to get done during the day and it's just really important so definitely eat a healthy breakfast. So, so those were my 10 tips on how to become a morning person. Let me know which one was your favorite and which one you guys are going to try in the comments below because I would love to know and I love talking to you guys. And if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you guys give this video a huge thumbs up for me. Let me know what other videos you guys want to see in the comments as well because I love hearing your guys' ideas and what you guys want to see. So definitely let me know your video requests and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys! Mwah.